It was named by elementary kids and created by college students. But a new documentary captures a timeless moment as Catholic-based education continues to change. Iowa News reporter Walt Buteau has more on the last days of St. Brendan School. The face has changed from school to school, but these last days at St. Brendan's will seem familiar to you. We've all left high school and we've all left uh, like middle school. We remember the emotions of actually leaving the past behind. Students whose great grandparents went here and their teachers tell you how hard it was to let go. My students standing up and giving me an ovation, you know, it just made me cry. Like other Catholic schools, attendance was down, even if hope was high as ever. We hoped right up until March that well, maybe we could pull that rabbit out of the hat. Maybe the tide will turn. And the community lost a little piece of itself because that school had to close. This crew of three collected 14 hours of interviews and whittled it down to 35 minutes. Nick, are you getting interviewed now? No. No, you're not. <laughs> <laughs> the director, a St. Brendan graduate. It, it just felt like home. It was comfortable. Everyone was nice. They gave everyone the freedom to be creative. They left naming the documentary to its most important element. What do you guys think I should name this documentary? Of course, you get the 7th and 8th graders who are like, I don't know, I don't know. Billy. Billy? A couple kids who want you to name it their name for some reason. A little girl who wants us to name it Billy. Give it to me. The St. Brendan's movie. The movie wrapped up with a song as simple and as sharp as the title. The song itself is called Goodbye. And over the intercom, the teacher says, you know, it was great being part of this community with you, and uh, we're going to love and miss you. just hits you in a spot where kids you because these kids you realize what these kids are going through these kids are leaving these kids are not going to get to see these teachers again not going to walk the halls they didn't want it to be over so they just kept singing until the last person left they're still working on how and where to distribute the movie but in the meantime if you want more information or to potentially get a copy log on to our website and we will link you to that key information on Westminster Street in Providence Walt Buteau Eyewitness News. The search for